In sad, albeit expected news, the Los Angeles country's coroner's office has come out and confirmed that Chester Bennington killed himself via hanging. This official cause of death reflects what authorities have said they discovered at the late Lincoln Park singer's home last Thursday morning, after they responded to a 911 call and discovered Bennington's corpse. The artist was only 41 years old at the time of his death. He had a history of mental illness and substance abuse, along with a past of sexual abuse as a child. Now, just a few days after Bennington took his own life, the 911 call made on his behalf has been released to the public. In the following video, we heard the artist's driver speaking calmly to an operator while Bennington's house made cries and screams in the background. She's the one who entered the singer's home and came across his limp body. I just got to the location and his housekeeper came out and said he killed himself. He hung himself, says the driver. As the driver relays more details on the phone, the housekeeper continues to be heard, crying hysterically as she speaks to Chester's wife on a different phone. Lincoln Park released an emotional statement honoring their frontman Monday morning, writing on Facebook. The demons who took you away from us were always part of the deal, after all, it was the way you sang about those demons that made everyone fall in love with you in the first place. You can read the full statement from the band, which Bennington joined back in 1999, here. Chester is survived by wife Talinda Bennington, their son Tyler and twin daughters Lily and Leela, as well as his three children from previous relationships. 